Oh shoot! Ah! Hey, hey, hey! Welcome to my channel, everyone! I am the Global Cherry, and today we will be doing Little Nightmares 1. Before we begin, subscribe, like the video, share the video, and turn on post notifications. Oh my gosh, Roger is sniffing so loudly. He has a nasal problem. Oh, that's creepy. Those dolls will haunt anyone's nightmare. Hi ho, hi ho. It's time to really go. You're going to the next room to play with your dolls, Roger? All right, go play with your Barbie dolls. I don't judge you, Roger. I made a mistake. Six can't climb! Oh! Ah! <laughs> How is your arm so long? Hold on to the monkey doll and throw it! Wait till he leaves the room. You missed, Roger! This is the power of childhood! What if he just wanted to give children toys, but then he's just sad because children are afraid of him? Mmm! I see you're doing sit-ups. Or chin-ups. Nice exercise routine, Roger. Okay, dude, run! <laughs> Roger's here! He heard the clock, didn't he? Oh, okay, he heard me! Run! Six! Six, run! He's chasing you! He's really fast! He's really fast! For someone who's blindfolded, Roger moves very fast. Six will get out of here. I'll save you from that creepy man. The dude probably wanted to play with Barbie dolls. No wonder he owns so many dolls. Oh yes, we dodged the piano keys. Can Six make the jump to the next bookshelf? Oh yeah, books are falling everywhere. We're ruining Roger's library. Oh, hey, Roger. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you got some business to attend to? No? You're just going to stay here and wait for a little raincoat girl to run past you? He went into the other room. He wants to read more of his novels. What taste in books do you have, Roger? Do you like fiction? Nonfiction? Historical novels? What kind of genres do you like, Roger? Dude, he's sniffing the air so intensely. You know what Six should do? She should like rub perfume all over like one area of the bookshelf so that Roger would stay there. Avoid him! Make sure he can't reach you! He's trying to feel around the bookshelf, huh? Oh no! What kind of novels do you like, Roger? Ah yes! The physics of how to throw children. Interesting novel indeed. Yeah, distract him for a bit.
Get inside the room before he does! Maybe Roger can't open doors. Let's put this item here. Maybe we can turn on the TV and distract him? Let's play Roger's favorite show. Yeah, co watch your show! You really like your show, don't you? Oh, that show is so creepy. What song is this? I really do love the tears of children. You must have been a teacher in your past life. Six, just run. He's distracted by the TV for now. You gotta go. My adrenaline is kicking up so quickly. He might turn off the TV by accident. This is my theme song. I'm pushing this lever so loudly. Am I screwed? Yes, yippee. Oh, you go. Ah! Dude, keep running just in case Roger's arm can reach me from miles away. The music isn't stopping. Please don't stop the music. Apparently we interrupted Roger's show. Just keep watching your show. Binge watch many episodes of that same song. Did I just die? I can hear something move. Roger? Are you mad that I- ah! Yep, he's mad that I interrupted the show. He loved that music video. Let me sing it for you. Hello, hello. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Roger, give up. You don't have to get all handsy over there. Dude, is Roger still over there? Yep, Roger's definitely over there. Hey, Roger! It looks like I'm going to be leaving! Ah! Dear old jolly good Roger. Please leave me alone. Dude, his hands are reaching everywhere. Dude, close the door on his arms. Make sure he can't use them anymore. Stop being so handsy. Keep your hands to yourself, Roger. Pervy Roger. Ooh, <laughs> this is so creepy. Can't touch this. Da, na, 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 na. I need to go for the cage once his arms are open. You can't grab me! Oh yes! We finally did it, but ew, his arm is cut off! That's so gross! Ugh. Poor Roger, he lost both of his arms. Ooh, we're hanging from a hook! Whee! But are these hooks for carrying children? The bodies are just hanging there. Ooh, looks like we met our next monster in a chef costume. Oh my gosh, Gordon Ramsay turned into a monster. Are you hungry again, Six? Any food in here? Another rat? Six, you are disgusting. Mm -mm. We have to eat the rat. You couldn't just wait till we got to the kitchen and then I could have fed you some vegetables or some other meats. You had to eat an alive rat. I think you should get tested. You disgust me, Six. Okay, climb into this room. It looks like a kitchen or storage room. Six, you were hungry before. There's so many vegetables. You could literally eat them right now. You won't be hungry for days. Get a carrot. You don't want carrots? Now it's not a time to be a picky eater, Six. I hear knives. This must be the chef of the maw. Ooh, you're hideous. Ugh. Gordon, what have they done to you? 
They turned you into a monster and now you're stuck here cooking for them for all eternity. That's hell right there. Are you still you? The steak is bloody raw. Yep, I guess you're still you. Ew, did you just cough? Man, the chef has COVID. So unsanitary. You didn't see me! Oh gosh, I think you saw me get into the shell. You didn't see anyone, chef! Oh jeez, oh jeez. Where are you going? Oh, that's so disgusting, you just copped in your food. Do you guys still even eat the food? Do you sneeze on your food too? You didn't see anything, chef. Just keep making some of those dishes. How many guests do you even have? Oh, the gnome is waiting for me. Can it see me from under the desk? <laughs> oh! Oh gosh! It saw me, it saw me, it saw me. Can it reach me from under there? Oh, he can't reach from under the desk. Your hand is too big for that crack, huh? That fish is so raw. It's still alive and singing in the Little Mermaid. Dude, that was a close one. Imagine if it came here for ingredients. Oh, I'm scared. Six, just sneak up above him. He might see you, but he can't reach you. Let's throw this jar over here so the fake chef will go and check. Hey, someone's been breaking your seasoning. Yeah, it's just nothing. It's just your seasoning broke. It must be the wind, right? Ugh, you look like Jabba the Hutt from Star Wars. You could literally be Jabba the Hutt's long lost brother. So many things is wrong with the chef. Look, even the stew is black. You didn't season the stew properly, you don't- No! Oh, we got into the vents. Ew, there's like two toilets stuck together. Do these chefs go to the washroom at the same time? Do they do their business in here at the same time? That's gross. Oh, there's the gnome here. Where are you leading me to, buddy? Where are you leading me to? I've been seeing you guys everywhere. What are you guys? Looks like Jabba the Hutt is taking a nap over there. Enjoying your nap? Yeah, Master Chef really tired you out, didn't it? Eh? Eh? Oh no, he woke up. We woke Java up. That was very close. My heart just went up so quickly. Six almost got us killed again. Let's go get the key before the dude comes back. Cause I feel like when he comes back, there's no waking up. Come on, grab the key. We have the key now, so I think we can unlock that locked door where the chef was. I'm kind of nervous. Does that mean he's nearby? I hate this. Hurry before fake Gordon comes back. Did the chef notice that we have a new guest? What's going on? Why is the numb going into the storage room? No, hide in there! Why did you ride me out, gnome? He's gonna come in the storage room. If you want me to help you, you have to do it silently. 
Dude, he's gonna notice the key. Don't take the key, please. I went through so much to get it. I'll go free you. He's coming back. Dude, quickly hide. No, you have to hide. He's going to do something to you if you don't hide. He might put you in a stew. I don't want you to get hurt. Oh no, he's approaching. Wow, that's a great hiding spot. Oh, that's so disgusting, he just coughed. Hey, you're okay now. Oh, we can hug each other, that's so cute. I didn't know we could hug the gnomes. I guess we're doing the same pattern again. Hide from the chef and move on. Oh, okay, he found me. He found me, he found me. Okay. You didn't see me, did you? You saw a girl, but you saw an illusion. What did you even put in the oven, pal? You didn't put anything in the oven. Okay. Let's quickly go and unlock that door. Here at the door. Time to go. Dude, girl, quickly run. We need to make sure he doesn't cook us. I don't want to be rotisserie chicken in this nightmare land. Is this the place where they make sausage? Look, hot dogs are good, but I don't want to become one. So the gnomes led me here for what? To do free labor? You know, child labor is not legal. Oh, we're making a trail of sausages, it looks like. Okay, give me the sausage bridge. It looks like we don't have enough meat. Huh? Does this lead to the dumpster or something? Oh, this leads to the actual meat locker. I don't even know where this meat came from. Okay, let's use our parkour skills, huh? One, two, three. Hold on to that disgusting piece of meat. Let's put this nice piece of meat on the trap. I'm doing free labor for you, chefs. You don't even have to pay me. We have two pieces of ham to make our sausage. We're supposed to reach that exit, right? Yeah. I don't think that's the direction we're supposed to be swinging, Six. Oh, we're in the ventilation. There are more dead bodies here. Great. I don't want to die. There's a hidden box in here for some reason. I feel like that body bag is talking to me. <laughs> Help. Me, please. It looks like we have another elevator and a locked door here that we need to unlock. Let's do that. Okay, let's get the elevator up. Oh, hi. Oh, uh, don't look here. <laughs> I became chicken broth. So I guess this is what that box was for. Okay, let's try it again. Okay, now run. Enjoying a great time here, Chef? What brings you here to the freezer? You need some ingredients? Playing Diner Dash wasn't enough for you? What is that? You're pulling out rotten cheese? Mmm, Gouda. Gouda cheese. So good, the blue cheese. Actually, can you actually share that with me too? I have weird hunger spells and I need to eat something right away. Suckers, too fast, too slow. You should have thought about what was in the box. Your love for cheese was too big. Open the elevator door right now. He's chasing me through the elevator, right? Yeah, he also took the elevator as well. You cared so much for that cheese. 
Isn't the cheese enough for you? You needed to eat another child as well? Such a greedy chef. He eats all the ingredients. Ooh, there's a key right where he's cutting the meat. How am I gonna get it though? You don't have to cut the meat so aggressively, you know. He's cutting it like it's the cousin he hates so much. Damn you, Bob. Damn you. Is that a mask or is that his real face? Okay, run. Go grab the key! Get into the elevator, see you later chef! Enjoy cutting your meat miserably! Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear! Go quickly unlock the key! Six, what are you doing? Oh no, oh no! See you later! <laughs> you almost caught us! I saw my life flash before my eyes, my tiny life. I'm staying in this place forever. Maybe I can snack on some vegetables and live with the gnomes. Are we still stuck here or can we go here? Oh, okay, we're in the dumpster. So many cans and shoes are being thrown away. How are we going to escape the chefs? It looks like there's so many of them. Oh look, the Grimm brothers decided to wash some dishes for their guests because they had a wonderful buffet, right? Look at all those dishes. How many guests did you even have? Help me. End my suffering, please. The dishes are endless. Endless. Wait, we have to actually get up here in front of them? Okay, see ya. You saw nothing. The Grimm brothers are trying to chase me. Can you reach your hands in here? Yeah, you can't see me, can you? You're literally looking at me. How can you not even get me? Oh, that's just gross, man. That's gross. How am I supposed to get past them? One of them is over the dishes. One of them is in the sink. Okay, let's actually run past them and hide somewhere. Jeez, we alerted them. What are we supposed to do? Press the lever? It's gonna make so much noise and we have to escape again? Go check it out. Oh shoot! Ah! I hate you. You're trying to put me into your stew. He's walking over here, right? You can't see me! Okay, why are both of the Grim brothers searching for me? What can you even use for me? An ingredient? You want to use me as a sponge to wash your dishes? Dude, climb onto the sink. Hey, you can't reach me from there, huh? Try to reach me. I know you're almost there. You're almost there. You're almost there. I know, just give it a little tug, your arm. Oh, you can't reach me, Ryan. Oh, that's too bad. You wanted to use me as a soap sponge, huh? Well, that's too bad, Grim Brothers. See you later! I know. I'm flying under your grasp, huh? Oh, they're actually chasing me, wow. Can't touch this! You won't be able to grab me, Grim Brothers. I'm flying away, I'm getting out of this kitchen. Oh, did I die? Oh, okay, the chefs are actually chasing me. They're actually chasing me! Oh, you couldn't reach me from there, could you? Ah! Oh, you're hungry, aren't you? The guests want what they want, huh? Yes! I finally escaped from them! <laughs> you can't reach me! Did you just throw a wine bottle at me? That's rude. That's not how you treat your guests. No! Six! Dude, these pipes are slippery. We finally escaped the chefs. 
The Grim Brothers won't be using me as their stew or their sponge. Now that we defeated Roger, I think I'm going to end the episode right here. That is all for today. If you enjoyed the episode, please make sure to subscribe, like the video, share the video, and turn on post notifications. Thank you for watching, and that's all.